So the next video will be the next installment for The Prince and the Pauper, which is Chapter 1, The Birth of the Prince and the Pauper. In the ancient city of London, on a certain autumn day, in the second quarter of the 16th century, a boy was born to a poor family of the name of Carty, who did not want him. On the same day, another English child was born to a rich family of the name Tudor, who did want him. All England wanted him too. England had so longed for him and hoped for him and prayed God for him, but now he was really cool. The people went nearly mad for joy. Mere acquaintances hugged and kissed each other and cried. Everybody took a holiday, and high and low, rich and poor, feasted and danced and sang, and got very mellow. And they kept this up for days and nights together. By day, London was a sight to see, with gay banners waving from every balcony and housetop, and splendid pageants marching along. By night, it was again a sight to see, with its great bonfires at every corner, and its troops of revellers making merry around them. There was no talk in all England but of the new baby, Edward Tudor, Prince of Wales, who lay lapped in silks and satins, unconscious of all this fuss, and not knowing that great lords and ladies were tending him and watching over him, and not caring either. But there was no talk about the other baby, Tom Carty, lapped in his poor rags, except among a family of paupers whom he had just come to trouble with his presence. So that is the first chapter of The Prince and the Pauper.